Lopez, Alex Rodriguez top rumor of 2017, getting married and having babies. Jennifer Lopez and Alex Rodriguez didn't get married or have a baby in 2017, despite a tabloid insisting earlier this year that both milestones would take place. Gossip Cop exclusively debunked the story as soon as was published. With the year coming to a close, it's been proven unequivocally untrue. Life and Style published a cover story back in March strongly reporting that Lopez and Rodriguez were planning a wedding and having a baby, the decision they supposedly made while on vacation in the Bahamas. An alleged insider told the magazine, both Jennifer and Alex know what they want, and they want to be husband and wife, sooner rather than later. They'll be married by the summer. They weren't. The outlet's dubious insider further claimed that the couple would welcome a child shortly after their summer wedding, adding, Adoption is the way they'll go. Jen has said she won't undergo IVF, so they'll either adopt from Puerto Rico, where she is family, or the Dominican Republic, where Alex's family is from. That didn't happen either. Sources close to the singer and former MLB star assured Gossip Cop in March that they weren't dying the knot or adopting the baby, and they still haven't done either of those things now that 2017 is ending. It should be noted, the couple's relationship appears to be going quite strong. So perhaps one or both of these developments will occur sometime down the road, but neither has happened just yet, and they most certainly didn't happen over the summer. Also, Life and Style had trouble keeping its lies straight this year. After initially asserting that the singer would be adopting a child instead of conceiving one herself, the tabloid claimed in late May that Lopez was pregnant with Rodriguez's miracle baby. Had that been true, the singer would be more than seven months pregnant by now, which she isn't. Unfortunately, Gossip Cop suspects there will be plenty of more false rumors printed about the high-profile couple in 2018.